the adventurers, welcome to the channel, welcome to my playthrough and this is Juan, I'm your host, nice to meet you in case you're new here. I am playing on Tactician, Baldur's Gate 3, Merrick Romaldus is my water main, Mono Cleric. I want to show you what you can actually do with a real cleric without multiclassing him, even though he's a good base for that. Um, yeah, I've just defeated those giant eagles in a really huge fight. Uh, I'm in the mountain pass with level 6. I did start the underdark however, since I'm playing cleric I do want to um, have the maze of Lathander before I venture forth. So I un interrupted the underdark basically in order to, to get here and I hope I can actually handle the githyanki. Um, usually in my last playthroughs which I did without YouTube I most likely um, used to play let's say Underdark first, Mountain Pass after, but that's different now. So uh, this looks kind of weird. Sometimes uh, I figured out that especially when you level up, also he should be wearing a shield. Uh, if you level up you get a lot of spells which you, like sometimes they put spells in there which, which you haven't even selected. So that just happened to me. And I'm quickly gonna readjust. So, um, what can we use here? I think Revivity is out of the league. So, I think that <laughs> I don't even have much more options than this. Um, sadly, Silence is of course good. Hold Person can be nice. Um, I think Bane is possibly better than command in this regard. So I have no healer here, so Beacon of Hope doesn't really help, even though it takes 10 turns. So I might add uh, some some healing. I really switch my party a lot, so sometimes I even have Shadowheart in here, but as for now I'm I'm basically not playing with Shadowheart and this is why I take my support spells in there. You can actually play double cleric, there's no problem. So uh, also you don't need any specific builds in order to play Tactician, it's really just up to you. The really key ingredient in Baldur's Gate 3 to not lose fights, I see a lot of posts online um, for people who are just diving into D&D and especially Baldur's Gate. I mean, I've played Baldur's Gate 1 and 2, totally different edition. But nevertheless, Baldur's Gate is not Diablo. I play Diablo too, so uh, that's no offense uh, meant here. It is just really, really different. So it is uh, about tactical fights. A one level difference means a lot, actually. And you should always figure out... Oh, so... You should always figure out who is actually... What kind of, what kind of level your opponents have for which area. And you shouldn't take any any fights. Like I wouldn't be here with level 3. Uh, you could do that, certainly, but it, it's perhaps like really tough and you probably will actually lose. So here's the Guardian. Um, 60 HP. I don't have Gale here, so uh, you can just press T and you will see he's level 7. Uh, has a pretty basic stat line. However, we just did a permanent uh, long rest. After long rest you can always cast your um, you know, your concentration spells because they will most likely stay until it's done. Uh, what's in here? So, uh, I don't know if he gives XP, but we can also enter here in the window. Just go around that. How do we come here? We can go there. Enter this room. And this room actually is... Oh, that's an interesting approach to reach that room. Quick step. I think they could have just... <laughs> this is a classic here. And Baldur's Gate. Um, so in that room there is a... I don't know what's going on here. Like, Astaran is like... What the hell? 
Okay. It's all come down now. I might take my main character to this title. Title of a star run. So we jump over. And here we go. Here is actually kind of a <laughs> it's kind of an a quest. And you have to figure out Dawn Master for Said. You have to really figure out what's where. Dawn Master, and once you complete this um, trial, you will get actually a key for taking Lathander's weapon. But you can also take Lathander out just like that. And you will have to deactivate some um, defensive mechanisms then. So I'm just gonna spare. Um, I'm just really gonna spare us. Mm. Now you see. Oh. I think you have to activate all the ultras and then you will get um the key let's see 5 to 14 i think we are fine with this can i 5 to 14 as well so but this one gives me actually the big punch right so this really absolute powers are really really nice and they do not come with this lazelle however 8 to 18 still better 8 to 19, so I'm pretty well equipped, so I don't actually need those. Should but it's nice to have it anyway. Times. So let's go out here. Wonder if the gods are watching me. It's a beautiful designed area. I think it always reminds me of uh, Avatar The Last Airbender. I suspect we will find another one of the trial elements. No, we don't. Maybe the spear, but that doesn't really matter. Oh, God for sake. Heavy, heavy rock steady. Just gonna put all the stuff on Carla. She's a big girl. Could certainly help me carry. I mean, I could have also just smacked the other stuff. And a remarkably long -lasting one at that. Of course, Karloff just goes into that. A star on as well, so on top of the group. Watch your back. Don't linger. Hit or smash the F5 button. And I think I don't know. So I'm just, just gonna. Activate it. I don't know if it gives XP. Oh, I can actually give my War God's blessing on someone else. Ooh. God, every time you hit him, he will just hit back. That's ridiculous. Just gonna get out of here. Okay. How? What? What? I blasted him, however. I don't know how or. But I certainly did. Trust me. Star on top of hit, anyway. These scrolls, you can actually learn them if you're a wizard, you can put them in your inventory to actually do and play with it. Mm. What's that? What do we have here? That's interesting. Looking ahead. Let's see the wall. Maybe I should do that with someone who has a bit more to offer. Uh, coming back to you in a second. So yeah, I <laughs> I did open this door. Let's 
so I think we're done here so let's oh we can go up here or not I don't know so let's go down and start our adventure with the Giz Yankees have a lot on my mind and um, well in it and here as well you have to jump you have to jump down actually oh stupid could have just walked a bit. Take all the stuff. And I think we're going... If we're going down here, we can actually leave the quiche and enter it from behind. Here is actually a chest. Which can be nice, but we want to go in there. And the main entrance is here. And uh, in this, oh, Infernal? In this uh, playthrough, what we're gonna do is... I sometimes it's really buggy, so I really don't know what's going on. They could have all just jumped there without it getting any anything hurt. Pretty unnecessary. So our kind of failed. I think we cleared most of it, and do want to get into the outpost. Some smacking. Is it a trap? right click attacker never did that whatever is necessary to go to go through this so now we safe and this is where we are entrance in the githyanki area gotta be careful here wanna play it slow wanna play it safety still not where are we Don't remember. That's not the Githyanki entrance. I don't remember it being at the spec. Maybe we go in here. Here's uh, some loot to be found. I will do that off camera. I know here it goes down actually. It goes down. The good thing here is because we closed the door, which is kind of weird. Uh, actually, the the rest of the Githyanki weren't alarmed. So that is a good thing. You gotta loot all of this. Fruit porridge? What the heck? Alrighty. So yeah, we can loot all this stuff uh, later. I will do the looting out out of action, I was about to say. I will do the, uh, the, whole, the whole looting uh, off camera because it doesn't really give you much if I run around and pick up loot. Um, yep. So we open the door and I will let you enjoy a nice cutscene and we will try to close the door. Also, uh, I can suggest to actually block the way let's march. with, let's say, Carla. And Astarion. Well, hello. Here we go. And then we have save game. Right here, and trigger the cutscene. Not reaction. I've got a long road ahead. There's a parasite nearby. You should vertical so, incision. Enjoy. to end of notochord. Intestinal coloration consistent with samples 231 to 259. Do you have a question? Or are you just going to stand there gawking? I am a child of gith, not discarded rat flesh. Am I not due your respect? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let the istic with you speak. 
and I will decide what respect you're owed. Lazel, is it? Fine. And be quick. My work is of vital import. We carry gate. You are either your tadpole. Go to the safest. The apparatus at the top of those stairs. Even Gig Yankee rarely experiences safest. You are very lucky, is it? Enough waiting. I crave blood. The device is strange. Made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. The Zathisk. Vlackett's purity distilled. My duty. My right. Praise Blacketh. Let it be done. Sit, child. Yeah, feel free. Not rushing here. Uh, so actually here, no matter what you're gonna do, I think it's gonna turn out the same way. Um, I can't say for, you know, some reason, but I think it's gonna be fine. You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zathisk will do the rest. An unseen blade cleaves your mind in two. Impossible pain sears your bones and body in concert with Lazel's. The Zathisk's psionic forces batter Lazel's thoughts. There is no chance she will survive this unscathed. Yes, child, speak the Talakit. Meditate on its verses. You feel Lazel's mind rip and rupture. Is this purification? Is this the cure? Oh guys, sorry. <laughs> I kind of uh, skipped the cutscene here. So, there's a couple of checks you can make. Um, accidentally, I wanted to mute me and skip the <laughs> skip the whole scene uh, recording. No, turn-based mode. Uh, really important here. You were lucky I was there to save you once So again. she will directly run off and um actually the machine broke and now can't give up now. We cannot allow her to escape. She's really fast. You have to go into turn based mode really quickly. And now I'm um trying to smack her. And now we have it. I think she wants to somehow. She wants to actually speak to others about what she's seeing or whatever. 
However, you should never let her go. That's important. So, now we've done that. You can also pick up Parasite the parasites. With magic. Take it. She actually collected them, which is good for us. I think there's another one. What's in here? Now with us. We, we take this. And this is it for this playthrough, I think. Um, we did have it. I'm just gonna long rest now because the next fight will be a bit a bit longer. And let's see what happens here. So this is uh, part one. Now, um, once we go out of this uh, uh, about this <laughs> happy <laughs> about this area, it's actually I followed should protocol. be like before. I kept to my faith. Yet the safest might have killed me. The gods still tampered with it. Traitor. And there may be more still. This must be why the Inquisitors come. Mm. Vlakith does not abandon Githyanki. The Zaythis was tampered with. There is no other explanation. No hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Doctor's sedition. So, um, let's take a look. We have three lars. Um, what could be good for our paladin, uh, for our cleric, actually? I could actually also enhance uh, Lavelle. I crave blood. Um, but Careful. I want to try in this playthrough. Oh, what's that? That's actually really good on Asara. I've got a long road ahead. So we don't need the forest tunnel. That's actually not a good one. I would like to have ability drain. This place is good. Repulsor is good. That's actually really good, so I'm gonna try for that. This is also good to go for a critical. So, use that. Have to keep going. And I don't know if we want to respec or not, but um, I think we are don't pretty touch me. pretty good here. As you see, we have not much issues with level 6 in this area. Level 5 gets a bit harder. Level 4, really hard. Level 3, don't. I, I don't know why would you go here with a level 3 actually. Hmm. Simple. That's critical. Let's see what happens. And oh, no, again. Oh, it goes down. Cut off! I know that's like the history of Baldur's Gate and also all these games like Icewind Dale that you have no... Like once you kill an opponent you will not respawn and stuff like that. It's um, part of the progression you do here. So, um, but I would still love to have some randomness in there, like the chests are always on the same spot and stuff like this. I would really love to have some variations in that, but not sure. So, right now we will want to talk our way through. Eventually, I think we have to kill them all. I expected no visitors, faithful or otherwise. Why have you come? So maybe this, or maybe we that. We seek the Saithisk. Show me the way. You are infected. A gig thrall is something to eradicate, not reason with. The faithful may be purified. This is Vlakith's protocol. Chuk. Fine. Chuk. Let the Gustil carry out your fate. Report to the infirmary at once, and step carefully. Crescia like watches you. Yeah, I bet. So, as you see, they are level 5, so you shouldn't go here before you hit level 5. And certainly, 
by that amount of uh, opponents, you should actually try and get level six instead. I heard they're making us join the patrol soon. The search must be going <laughs> back. I'm gonna show you some funny. Maybe not. Maybe I'm gonna do that later. You can actually paint on that. So here. Fun fact. So we go here. Right now we're still friendly. While we ungroup. This is like the training camp and uh, actually like normally. Nothing here. Let's be quick. Nothing here should happen. It's gonna, it's gonna be a tough fight here. So I think I want it's three people. So I need the best of best here, which will be. I might get Shadow out in the party for this. A bit more tankiness could couldn't. Shouldn't be bad actually. Karlach has Misty Step, however. Can I do anything? The touch already it doesn't make a difference. I was safe. I will need that for sure. Spirit Guardians I will need. Your magic is considered the fair of scoundrels. Lucky, and uh, I think we're going to start. I tried to get a vision here because if you start without any line of sight in that regard, I think um, if I trigger, if I trigger it now, I hope we will have a complete fight. Uh, sometimes it's a bit buggy when you have two fights in one. Hmm. Your violence hasn't gone no. unnoticed. Like uh, important here is so that you keep the door closed. So right now exactly uh, this now triggered because I had actually drawn a line of sight between each of my characters, so uh, all would enter the fight simultaneously. And let's see what I can do to finish her right now. I don't think I can do that any longer. Maybe hit. Or maybe I should just give it to her. Hmm. I'm gonna get some serious hits here. Ooh. Why is... Okay, okay, okay. So here, see, it's level 5 and they are pretty good in stat lines, so... You actually don't want to really mess around with them. Uh, he is strong. He is strong. 68. He's not so strong. So I will try to make him drop his weapon. First of all, bleeding. And now this arm. Exactly. Just actually taking him out already. Um, trying to. Do palm strike. I will immediately go action search here and disarm her as well. Exactly. Maybe I can even I can even kill her. Like a disarmed opponent, um, he's bleeding. He's threatened. Temporary hostile. Uh, he will get damage now and actually will have to pick up his weapon in order to do anything. Karlak took some serious hits, however. Um, Action search. Yeah, hope she will survive it. What's about to come? 
And now we are going to have a spiritual weapon here to support the situation there. And maybe I'm just gonna hit him. Like maybe I can do absolute power on him to knock him back. What do I have to lose? No, that didn't do anything. Oh, interesting. Ah, they have Misty Step, I guess, with level 5 or. That right now happened simultaneously. So, bleeding, that's good. Um, uh, 4 to 16. Didn't kill her, obviously. Uh, she has. Five left, so I'm gonna do that. There should be someone else here, right? Like a kid or something, which was playing. Or did I kill it already? That's interesting. Yeah, I think he should die by bleeding so I can heal myself. I uh, double specter as a fighter. Trying to not go too much multi-class in here because... Yeah, War Cleric is actually nice because you get two attacks. I know it's nothing compared to a fighter but you can actually do something with them. So she died of bleeding, was expected. A star and maybe can finish him off. Sneak attack, almost. I don't think it will be enough to. Hmm. That was my bonus action. Sadly, she is imprisoned, so. My character now fights alone. I don't know how long that's gonna take anymore. But let's see. So I need vision. And actually, I can teleport here. And then I should be able to slay. Enough. Survival is all that matters. And now we need to break concentration here. That is it. Another fight taken. Another win for the team. Someone there. Some headaches on my main character, I think. So now we can actually do some looting here. A good thing here is because we closed the door, which is kind of weird. Uh, actually, the the rest of the Githyanki weren't alarmed. So that is a good thing. You gotta loot all of this. Fruit porridge? What the heck? Alrighty. So yeah, we can loot all this stuff uh, later. I uh, will do the looting out out of action. I was about to say. I will do the uh, the whole uh, the whole looting uh, off camera because it doesn't really give you much if I run around and pick up loot. Um, yep, so we open the door and I will let you enjoy a nice cutscene and we will try to close the door. Also, uh, I can suggest to actually block the way let's march. with, let's say, Carla. Let's go. And Astarion. Well, hello. Here we go. And then we have save so game right so here fun. and trigger the cutscene. Not reaction. I've got a long road ahead. There's a parasite nearby. You should thirty percent so, decision. Enjoy. Daniel I to end of notochord. 
Intestinal coloration consistent with samples 231 to 259. Do you have a question? Or are you just going to stand there gawking? I am a child of gift, not discarded rat flesh. Am I not due your respect? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let the istic with you speak. And I will decide what respect you're owed. Lazel, is it? Fine. And be quick. My work is of vital import. We carry gift. You are either your tadpole. Go to the safest. The apparatus at the top of those stairs. Even Gift Yankee rarely experiences safest. You are very lucky, is it? Enough waiting. I crave blood. The device is strange. Made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. The Zathisk. Vlackett's purity distilled. My duty. My right. Praise Blacketh. Let it be done. Sit, child. Yeah, feel free. Not rushing here. Uh, so actually here, no matter what you're gonna do, I think it's gonna turn out the same way. Um, I can't say for, you know, some reason, but I think it's gonna be fine. You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zathisk will do the rest. An unseen blade cleaves your mind in two. Impossible pain sears your bones and body in concert with Lazel's. The Zathisk's psionic forces batter Lazel's thoughts. There is no chance she will survive this unscathed. Yes, child, speak the Talakit. Meditate on its verses. You feel Lazel's mind rip and rupture. Is this purification? Is this the cure? Oh guys, sorry. I kind of uh, skipped the cutscene here. So, there's a couple of checks you can make. Um, accidentally, I wanted to mute me and skip the <laughs> skip the whole scene uh, recording. No, turn-based mode. Uh, really important here. You were lucky I was there to save you once So again. she will directly run off and um actually the machine broke and now can't give up now. We cannot allow her to escape. She's really fast. You have to go into turn-based mode really quickly. And now I'm um 
trying to smack her. And now we have it. I think she wants to somehow. She wants to actually speak to others about what she's seeing or whatever. However, you should never let her go. That's important. So now we've done that. You can also pick up the parasites. With magic. Take it. She actually collected them, which is good for us. I think there's another one. What's in here? Nevertheless. We, we take this. And this is it for this playthrough, I think. Um, we did have it. I'm just gonna long rest now because the next fight will be a bit a bit longer. And let's see what happens here. So this is uh, part one. Now, um, once we go out of this, uh, uh, about this <laughs> happy, <laughs> about this area, it's actually I should protocol. be like before. I kept to my faith. Yet the Zathis might have killed me. The gods still tampered with it. Traitor. And there may be more still. This must be why the Inquisitors come. Hmm. Vlakith does not abandon Githyanki. The Zathis was tampered with. There is no other explanation. Now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Doctor's sedition. So, um, let's take a look. We have three lars. Um, what could be good for our paladin, uh, for our cleric, actually? I could actually also enhance uh, Lazelle. I crave blood. Um, but I want to try in this playthrough. Oh, what's that? That's actually really good on Asara. I've got a long road ahead. So we don't need the forest tunnel. That's actually not a good one. I would like to have ability drain. This place is good. Repulsor is good. That's actually really good, so I'm gonna try for that. This is also good to go for a critical. So, use that. Have to keep going. And I don't know if we want to respec or not, but um, I think we are don't pretty touch me. pretty good here. As you see, we have not much Good issues luck. with level 6 in this area. Level 5 gets a bit harder. Level 4, really hard. Level 3, don't. I, I don't know why would you go here with a level 3 actually. Hmm. Simple. That's critical. Let's see what happens. And oh, no, again. What is it? Grimishka. This is uh, magic cats. So that's the cats you don't want to put... You don't want to put any magic on. Because they would just increase in size. Where is Lozo? She's still back. Yeah, grouping really helps. Um, let's just try. Maybe I can just long shot it. Okay. Maybe it's enough. No. Good. Good for me. And now, this is it. I think we can call it. Nothing else than this. That's a trap. So, uh,. And yeah, we've wasted a lot of um, good spells in this fight, and uh, the Githyanki area is actually pretty difficult, so I would highly suggest you to... I think we will have three more long rests in this dungeon, but could try it with one. I 
I've used everything, I think. Not sure. I will try it without and uh, see you in the next episode. We're going to have two very, very big fights, almost boss fights. And then we will get the Maze of Lathanda and uh, possibly the Egg here. And then we go down into the Underdark to the Grim Forge and proceed further on our adventure. Hope you like this playthrough. In case you haven't yet, make sure to like and subscribe to not lose any of the fut uh, future episodes. Also, I have a Dark Urge playthrough, completely evil, um, which you will be able to see soon. And that's it. Make sure to stay tuned. Thanks. Bye bye.